All right, this experiment's a bit old one. It's known as Scuba Steve or Diver Dan. Uh, budget teachers have different names for this. Uh, all you need is a plastic bottle, not too big because smaller kids can't use it very well. Plastic bottle with water filled crack pretty much to the top, right to the top. Now, in this case, we're going to be using a pet to make it go up and down inside our liquid. What you need to do is chop the end off just with a pair of scissors, just like we've done with this one. And underneath that, we just put a couple of nuts slid up that can't come out, which holds it upright so I can sit there and float. Now, this part here has a lot of air in it, so I can float, so it's buoyant. If I tie the top up, I've sealed our container, so if I press on the edges, pressure will go throughout the fluid and impact on our little pipette. What I'll do is I'll shove water into the bottom of that tube and water will go up and make that air bubble smaller. The area will be heavier, so when I squeeze down, down it goes. If I stop squeezing it, it will go back up again. Reason being is if I squeeze it, water goes inside our pipette, it gets heavier, so less buoyant, and drops down. If I stop squeezing it, air will push the water out, the whole pipette gets lighter, and up we go.